<laughs> is that what I think it is? Is this sound of destroyer egg that I must have somehow missed yesterday? And this is what we were actually looking for at the end of yesterday's video. We didn't know what we're looking for. Well, uh, yeah, that, that's exactly what it is. That's exactly what it is. Guys, welcome back. Welcome back to our Mega Modded Survival. Yesterday, we took down Nova the Destroyer, the big old Dodo Reaper. Yes, it's a thing. It's a hybrid of the two. It's a Dodo cross with a Reaper. I don't know how the two of them made a baby together, but they did. And we took it down. And then that one there laid another baby. Or technically an egg. I am the one who's going to lay the baby. Yeah, once we took it down, we were kind of asking the question, like, how do we get our own? I knew that there was a summoner. I knew there was a way to tame our own. And I guess I just must have completely missed the fact it laid an egg upon death. And, uh, well, here it is. Here it is. We're going to pick this thing up. We're going we're gonna to lay it. Well, no, it's already been laid. We're going to lay it in our base. We're going to put it in our base. And we're going to hatch the thing up. We're going to have our very own Dodo Reaper baby. Yeah, it's going to be exciting. It's going to be fantastic. Guys, before we get too far, if you do enjoy it, please go ahead and punch that thumbs up. Make it rain. Those thumbs ups. Look, I'm too excited. I want to go and get my Nova the Destroyer. So let's do this thing. The thing that we don't know just yet is how fast this thing is going to grow up. We don't know the maturation rate of it. So it might take a couple days to grow. It might take an hour to grow. It might take a couple minutes. We're going to learn that right this second together. You never really know. Uh, with these types of things, especially with these crazy modded bosses and that sort of stuff. Uh, they can have absorbently large, uh, <laughs> I guess, growth rates. They can also have rather quick ones. But um, yeah, I guess we're, we're about to find out, okay? But while it's doing that, we got some other things we got to take care of. So we'll be going and taking care of some other things. Also, I'm running down around really, really slowly. I'm going to really quickly, I'm going to quickly uh, fast travel just to see if this resets my, I don't know, my dude here. He's He's just running slow, like abnormally slow. And sometimes that happens. I don't know what causes it, but let's have a little peek here, eh? Much better. Look how fast I am. Also, my broodmother's kind of encroaching on our base over here a little bit. I might need to move them or something. But anyways, we've got our stuff back at least. So that's kind of nice. Um, but anyways, we've got our speed back. So that's good. I can actually move around with with, with style now. Um, but let's, let's go and drop this thing down and, and get the thing going. So I... Don't... Oh, well, I guess that's it. We've got an air conditioner at the back there. I was wondering if we're going to need a couple of them. But looks like one is doing the trick. This is a big old egg. I mean, obviously, we're standing next to it in the desert. It looks kind of big. Hold on a second. Is somebody's trying to steal my egg? No, it's just an itchy thornus. Where is the itchy thornus? Hello? How you doing there, mate? Can you come down here and fight me, please? Because I ain't got time. I'm trying to... I'm trying to... I need, I need to be there for the birth of my baby. Get out of here. Took my demonic eggs, you pile of trash. Turns out that while we were fighting in the desert yesterday as well, our demonic reaper empress over here was just laying eggs all over the place. Uh, I picked a few of them up, but now they're all gone because that itchy thorn has picked them up and destroyed them. And you don't get what itchy thorn has taken from you back, which is really, really upsetting. Uh, but anyways... I just had a little heart attack. My egg has disappeared. It's okay, though. Our hatchery over here is helping out. Should be helping out. Is it helping? It's helping out. There it goes. And it's pretty much ready to hatch. There we go. Let's do this thing. That was really, really, really fast. So let's make it happen. Let's do this thing. Let's drop it. And have a look who lays inside. There it is. <laughs> a level 316 over the destroyer. And we can actually get a good look at what this thing looks like now. And we can toggle the particles. But come on. We gotta, we're gonna let the, we'll let the particles run for a little bit. Um, before we can do anything, though, I do need to get this thing out of my base. Because, oh boy, this is going to be a... This, well, it's too big to be in my base. I probably shouldn't have... Uh, oh, shouldn't have hatched you in here, should I? Oh, I definitely shouldn't have hatched you in here. Um, okay, I might need to just grab the help of one of my little soul traps here. And we'll, we'll move you out of here, okay? Let's get you out of here. Out of the base. I don't want you getting stuck in here. You're too big. Or you're about to be too big. Uh, and it looks like, yeah, he's going to take a little while to grow up. Already 2.6% of the way there. It's actually growing pretty quickly, but it's, you know, it's going to get 100% of the way there. So it's got a little while to go. Um, my nanny over here is slowly imprinting it as well, which is fantastic. I couldn't remember if we actually had a nanny, but we do. So it's going to come out the other end of this 100% imprinted, which is great. Um, yeah, that's, that's fantastic news. All right, well, I'm going to let him sit there for the time being, and we're going to get into some other stuff, and we'll come check up on old Nova here, um, who is genderless. There's no male or female, so you can't breed these guys, I guess. But we'll come and check up on you in in due time, I suppose. But i got some other things I want to check out, because I had a little peek in here yesterday, and I forgot to mention it in yesterday's video. Have a look at this. We have ourselves an alpha boss egg. So it turns out... Our broodmother out here. We've got three of them now. <laughs> if you haven't been following, we've got 
Oh, you guys are actually in weird... Okay, that's why you're inside of my base. Interesting. Well, anyways, these two here are laying me regular boss eggs. This one here is laying me alpha boss eggs. Uh, well, one alpha boss egg. So I guess there is a chance that it does it. It's going to need a mate boosted pair. So what I want to do right this second, as soon as possible, basically, so we can start getting more alpha boss eggs. I'm going to let you sit there. And while you are, I'm going to go head out and try and get us uh, another alpha broodmother. Let's have a look at actually what is out there in the wild currently, because sometimes, well, we're actually lucky we got something. Uh, we are going to need a male, but actually, I think they're all... Now, I can't remember. I think we should be fine no matter what. The thing that's going to really hold this up if things don't go according to plan is the... Oh, we got 48 boss set. We're good. Never mind. We're fine. We are fine. So, alpha boss kibble. Alpha boss. This one right here. We're going to need like three of these. May. Hello. Cooked prime meat. Medjo berries. Okay, I had a little heart attack there and I was like... We had to go and go and like need to go and collect some stuff. But thankfully, it's easy stuff. So let's grab some real prime meat. We got lots of that everywhere. All right, drag it in, cook it up. There we go. That'll take care of that. We're going to go and get some medjo berries, which we still don't really have a dedicated harvester to do that for us. Maybe today we end up going and finally looking for a celestial Therizinosaur. In fact, I don't even know if Therizinosaurs can harvest berries. I know they're good at fiber, and I know that they're good at wooden thatch. I actually don't know if they do fiber, mate. We'll have to go look for something eventually. I do plan on doing it. We're just keeping getting distracted with other things. But anyways, that's Medjo Berries taken care of. And I guess last but not least, Alpha Kibble. So let's grab that as well. And we're going to need... I think I'm just going to grab 20. Oh, let's grab 20 of these. There we go. And we are going to go and pay an, uh, a visit to this level 100 one that we want to tame up. We're also going to have to craft up some tranks and that sort of stuff as well, but we'll get to that in just a second. Um, but for now, I want to see what sort of kibble amount we need for this broodmother, or at least the lowest of the level ones. 6170. Um, oh, it's, it's... My base... Okay, hold on a second. It's nearby. It's nearby. See, it's, it's like right up here, I think. And then this way. It's, it's literally... Okay, that's good. That's handy. I don't have to go too far to find this thing. That's always that's always a positive. It's going to literally be right down here. If it's above ground. 6170. It should be like right beneath us. Or over here a little bit more. There you are. Unless... No, that's just a regular broodmother. There's a lot of... Oh my gosh. Okay, there's... There's a lot going on in these swamps at the moment, eh? Um, okay. I don't... Okay, either way, I'm going to kill this thing. I want the boss essence. I need the boss essence, as a matter of fact. So we may as well go and collect the boss... Did I get the boss essence? Still alive. Okay, this thing's got some power to it. There we go. Thank you very much. Finally given in. Also, there's a demonic down here too. Capsuchus. I should probably tame another one of those up. But anyways... Uh, oh, wait. Still alive. Oh no, I'm gonna die. I'm dead. <laughs> as soon as I saw us hit the water, I knew that that was it. I knew we were done for. That's cool. At least we're like right next to base, like I said. The downside here, though, isn't my death. The downside is I couldn't find the Alpha Broodmother. Oh, so this Reaper is growing really fast. Oh my gosh. Uh, this thing's gonna consume my entire base. I wonder if it ends up bigger than this. I reckon they end up roughly the same size. Oh, so uh, maybe that's why I thought you were so small yesterday. Because I was comparing you to that, which is also really big. Okay, yeah, that, that would explain it. Um, anyways, we need to go and grab our stuff. Man, if only I could ride you, I'd bring you with me. Also, really quick, before I forget, let's grab you some meat. You're going to get hungry. So take some of that. There you go. And I think I can do this, actually. Can I grab my dinosaur? I can. All right, let's just bring our Spirit Griffin back. And we'll fly him back across. It's not too far. It's not that out of the way. But yeah, like I said, we have to go get our stuff now, don't we? And it's literally right here. Um, Alpha Brute Mother, though. I think we're going to find it is nowhere to be seen, which is highly unfortunate. But what are we going to do? It looks like whatever it was that killed us is gone. So that makes our stuff easy to reobtain, which is always nice. There we go. All right, and now I'm gonna go and check my scanner again to see if it's if it's in its existence. Alpha B, rude mother, sixty-one seventy. Is it underground or something? Sixty-one point seven seventy. Okay, 
So you should be up here. 61.7. It's, it's, I bet you it's under here. Is it, is it, hold on. I'm trying to like, it, it should be right here. Like right here. It should be right, unless it's in a cave. Why did all those rocks just go? Okay, I guess I destroyed the rocks. Um, I don't see the brood mother. It's meant to be here somewhere. I'm guessing it's underground. Okay, that's cool. Lucky for us, there's a few of these existing in the world currently, so we can just check out one of the other ones instead. Um, this one here, for example, 6046, and I'm pretty sure I got some teleporters closer to that. So we'll just go 6046, 64, yeah, that's pretty good. If I actually selected the teleporter. We head out to the green obelisk, which is actually really close to the base. I don't even, I don't even know why we teleport. I could have just flown over there just as fast as we are teleporting there, but it's all good. 60, 40 shicked. And I get the feeling this guy is going to, where am I flying? Flying in the wrong directions. I get the feeling, what am I doing? Ah, I've got all sorts of the wrong directions. I get the feeling this is going to be exactly where we've teamed up the last few of these that we've uh, gone looking for. Everything seems to just be in the same places, which, hey, at least it's uh, easy to find what we're looking for but it's just not fresh. It doesn't give me that fresh feeling of a fresh team in a fresh area. It just feels like the same team over and over again. All right, we have so many elementals in our world currently. It is actually crazy. Um, but 6046 should be right here. And I can hear, I can hear a chaos dinosaur doing chaos things. Hold on, is that it there? Alpha Stego, no, hold on. Is that you? That's it. That's got to be it. It's red. And it requires four kibble. Okay, that was my fear. It has 7.3 million torpor too. Okay. All right. Well, now we know what is required to make this happen. Let's go. Okie dokie. My dude here has grown even more. I guess that's what babies do, isn't it? They grow. <laughs> uh, how far along are you, buddy? Stuck okay. You got a long way to go still. You're only 37%. I kind of, you know what I want to do? I wanna, I wanna grab our little orb, pick you up. I'm gonna put it, I'm gonna put it next to our empress over here, and just so that I can like see them side by side as it grows, because I feel like it's gonna outgrow the empress, the destroyer. Uh -huh, like that's 37. Of, you know what? It's probably gonna end up the same. That, that would be the same size. That's my prediction right now. Anyways, let's see what we need to get this kibble going. Hey, we're pretty close, I think. Um, so let's let's have a little peek in here. We've already crafted up all of those. Uh, I need the alpha boss kibble. Four of these. We've got everything we need. Cool. All I now need is a team helper, which I've got right here. We're going to need a means to knock in this thing out. And you know what I'm going to do to do that? I am going to go... Since we now have 12 origin blood from killing all the origins lately, we're just going to go and get us a origin arrow. Keep things nice and simple, nice and quick and easy. We'll have this thing tamed up in a heartbeat. And um, hopefully, to match that, that will be giving us a nice amount of eggs as quick as possible as well. That'd be, that'd be super fantastic. If we can get some Apex eggs really, really fast, I'll be really happy maybe we can even get ourselves our first apex boss today that'd be that'd be that'd be a dream come true um even though today's all about baby <laughs> i was gonna say it's all about baby nova destroyer no it's not we've we spent like five minutes on nova the destroyer and um we keep him busy doing other stuff i guess anyways i'm gonna make sure this arrow hits otherwise i cry are we gonna see me all to cry today probably not there we go all I got to do is stay well out of this thing's way because as you know, when you hit it with one of these origin arrows, it doubles its speed and doubles its damage. So we just need to stay well away from it while it seeps in and it fills its torpidity to 100%, which should happen very quickly. It's already halfway. In fact, if you fall asleep right on that rock, I will be so happy because we have Primal Tech Stegos everywhere out here currently and these guys will ruin all of our fun. There's a few over here too. All right, we actually got to deal with these. Stay away from my broodmother. 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 There's still one here. Okay. Is that dead? Okay, I think we're good. Okay. Yeah, these primal techs are bad news. They are one of the only things that can really ruin our days at the moment uh, when we're taming these types of things in the wild. So we're just going to, you know, just remove them from the equation and try and do what we do without them here. So get that in there and i just realized i forgot my kibble wouldn't be the first time now would it no it is 100 not the first time we do this all the time be right back i'm going to get my four kibble that we just crafted up for this exact reason 
What is wrong with me? How do I always butcher this? It's actual so sad. It's it's terrible. It is terrible. How do I never learn? I actually never learn. All right, let's let's try this again, hey? Third time lucky, man. This is we've we've reached pretty much pretty much anything that could have delayed the progress on doing this has happened today. You know, one just not existing. We end up dying tr for no reason, killing things we just didn't need to be killing. Whatever. It is what it is. Also, look how close it was to three kibble two. That actually hurts. It means that should we have actually gone for the level 100 successfully, we, um, actually, I'm not going to, oh, yeah, we'll just teleport us out of here because otherwise I'm going to die. It's, this is going to happen right now. No, get me out of here. Get me out of here. Oh, well, I got the brood mother out of here at least, so that's good, but I'm about to bleed out again. No, I don't want to die. I told you the primal text there goes bad news, didn't I? I said it. I called it. Okay, we're getting out of here. I'm actually going to bleed out. I'm actually bleeding out. All right, teleport me home first. Teleport me home first. I don't want to bleed out out of here. Just, if I die, let me die in my base. Let me die in my home. Let me die when I'm, where I'm comfortable. <laughs> As you might be okay. I think we're good. I don't think I'm bleeding out anymore. But we've still got five seconds of this gash effect, whatever that means. Anyways, we're home. Um, Where's my broodmother? Guys, where did I teleport my broodmother to? Where's my bro Oh, no. Hold on, guys. Hold on. There wasn't a death message, was there? Like, our brood mother definitely didn't die, right? Is it still out here? Because it's not in my base. Oh, brood mother. Okay, where did I teleport it to? It, uh, what's that? It's big and it's red and it doesn't look like my brood mother. That's good. Where did I send the thing to? There's another one over there, by the way. Just, just on a side note. There he is. Do, do casual brood mother list over. Should I go and just light this thing up? Let me just light this thing up real quick. I want its boss essence. Um, even though we're not here looking for brood mothers currently. Wow, we just wiped out the entire swamp. Um, maybe I sent it to... Where would I have sent it to? Did I send it to the... No, 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 no. I might have sent it to the obelisk. Surely I didn't send it to the obelisk. All right, we'll check. We'll check the obelisk. What was I saying about anything that can go wrong? Like, has gone wrong today? No, I didn't send it to the... Where did I send this thing to? Oh, is that... Is that it? Okay. I don't know how this ended up here. But... Oh, boy. Not today. Please, please, please. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. Okay. We rescued it. But I have no clue what just... Okay. For some reason, it somehow ended up between the two locations. Don't ask me why. It's just what happened. And look at this thing trying to get back to fight. That Kano. Wait. Is that Kano... If he's loaded in, he might actually come down here to fight. Oh, who knows? Anyways, this brood mother is not cooperating with us. I don't know why. I don't know what its problem is. But let me stop, 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 stop. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. You're here to make me babies. So go and make me babies. <laughs> go and make me some eggs. All right, come over here. There you go. Okay, you two get to know one another. Make me some babies. That's really it. That's all I That's all I want to ask of you. And don't go anywhere. Don't go roaming off to fight no primals. Don't go unteleported else. I don't know where you were trying to run to. But just, just sit tight, chill out, and enjoy yourself, okay? I think what actually happened was I teleported it back here. And then he decided that he was going to try and run back to me because that Stego was trying to fight us. I think he was coming over to defend us. I think that's literally what went down. But either ways, it's here now. And that's all that matters. <laughs> now they can make me eggs. And that's all, that re that's all I want, really. So this one alpha boss egg is eventually going to become multiple, which is great. And then we'll be able to get us apex boss kibble. Except we need five of them per kibble. And then once that happens... I actually don't know what comes next. Uh, potentially an Apex Brood Mother. <laughs> that sounds so not exciting. Maybe... Nope. There's no Mega Picasses. We got a Dodo Wyvern. Ooh. Well, there you go. Okay, we're going to get ourselves an Apex Dodo Wyvern, potentially. That is what the future holds. At some stage. But whatever. What else does the future hold? Man, there's so much stuff for us to do that I'm, like, struggling to, like, keep us directed in a single direction. For example, we obviously fought over the destroyer yesterday. We're getting our ring currently. 
The alternative to that is pick on the creator, which obviously we need a whole lot of stuff to get. So we're nowhere close to that. We don't even need to think about that yet. And the only reason that we go fighting these ones here is if we want celestial versions of this thing right here, which I need to use soon. Otherwise, it's about to break down. This thing in my hand currently, the thing we just picked up, this here is called a demonic dissension item. Now, what we can do with this is feed it to one of our demonics and descend it, make it even stronger. Basically, just powers it up to a ridiculous amount. I can't just remember the exact stats and whatnot, but um, we can feed it to any of our demonics. We have three to choose from, obviously. We've got the, the Empress, the Thorny Dragon, and a Mispithicus down here, and uh, it would give him a big old speed boost. And every time we kill one of these, we're going to get another one of these. And obviously, we can do the same for our Celestials eventually too. So, who do we want to give it to is the question. I'm looking at, I'm looking up. I'm looking at, I think it's got to be the Empress, man. She's already such a beast. Let's make her even, I actually don't know if you can do that. Actually, now that I think about it. Yeah, you can. All right. Do I just consume it? This item would just send one of your demonics, put it in the inventory and use the multi-wheel. Do not consume. Oh, I nearly made a mistake. All right, so I guess I got to... Oh, maybe I can't use it on you. It's not on the multi-wheel. All right. What's meant to show up? Let me actually have a look here. If I put that in there. Ah, I can't descend her. Okay, that's disappointing. But you're obviously my second choice. So let's do this thing. Descend thy thorny dragon. And let's see what happens, eh? Whoa, okay. <laughs> I completely forgot that they like change their appearance we now have our very first fallen dinosaur a, f a fallen demonic thorny dragon so this is descended we lost all of the items that were on its inventory i hope there wasn't anything important there also i lost a saddle so that's a little disappointing but maybe we just got to craft up a freshie and by the looks of it it i think it i wonder does it keep the stats that we gave it beforehand Either way, it lets us go and level it up all over again. So yeah, okay, let's let's do it. Let's see let's see how strong our thorny dragon is now. In case it wasn't strong enough in the first place, we're about to uh, we're about to see what this thing's truly made of. You fallen? Oh, you're joking. So yeah, I wasted my saddle. I guess that's all there is to it. We'll get another demonic thorny dragon saddle then. I wonder if this one looks like a demonic saddle or if it takes the appearance of a fallen dinosaur. Let's have a look. We'll drop you in here. And it's still a demonic saddle. All right, well, let's see if your attacks change. I can't for the life of me remember how this entire thing plays out, but we're about to learn. Um, also, what happened to my max experience potions? Hold on a second. I had a bunch of them. Don't, uh, wait, no. No, 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 hold on. What did I do with my max exp Hmm. I had like three of them. What have I done with my max exp What? No. Hold on. Wait, what? You guys remember? What did it? Wait, what? Where are my max experience potions? Who would have them? I used one on our T-Rex yesterday before we fought the dude. Let me take these off you. They're not on you. All right, now I'm like, okay, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. They, they weren't on you when I... I didn't... Were they on... I'm, I'm, I'm seriously questioning whether they were on our thorny dragon when I just evolved it and they got wiped out. I had three of them spare. I swear, this isn't the first time I reckon this, this phenomenon has happened either. I feel like I've lost these things in the past too. Um, okay, XP. Large, medium, small. That's, that's, that's not... That's not, that's, okay. That's, these are all the experience potions we've got. These three right here. Where did my max ones go? Where are they? <laughs> they're gone. <laughs> they're, they're, they're hundred percent gone. What? I, 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 um, um, I don't know what to say. I don't know where they went really quickly i know exactly what we're gonna do though i'm gonna i'm gonna throw one of these on you so i can teleport you to me i need to check the desert i need to check where spirit rob di died maybe they're on spirit rob's body or like he's in his little bag but in saying that i'm pretty sure i checked it when i was looking for the egg that we found at the start well not that we found it at the start of this episode but the one that we picked up at the start of the episode there's a little backpack there spirit rob i'm pretty sure all it had was like a stack of meat it didn't have any potion maybe i lost him when i died 
Maybe I couldn't... Oh, maybe they're on my gravestone out here somewhere. Even, even that's going to be hard to find now as well. Oh, here we go. That wasn't too hard to find. <laughs> uh, typical me just talking myself out of things. Yeah, there's nothing on my gravestone. Okay. Um, they're what? Yeah, the backpack's going to be despawned by now too. Yeah, spirit. I'm pretty sure spirits rob, Spirit Rob's backpack had nothing in it. Oh, well. I guess that is what it is. What are you going to do? Now, I'm pretty... Oh, okay. There's some demonics and stuff out here. I'm pretty sure I also saw an Origin Kano out here when I was exploring earlier. So, I think what I'm going to do is um, I'm just going to unleash my, my little fallen friend out here. Come out here, buddy. Spirit Griffin. Um, you can probably... You can probably head back to base. I might need you, but I'll let you know if I need you in a second, mate. In the meantime, let's see what this thing here can do, eh? 100, actually, let's, let's give you a bit of a kickstart with all of the potions we've got. I don't know what happened to my other ones, though. I'm so disappointed about that. Uh, yeah, let's see what we can do here, eh? Let's have a look. Yeah, there's, there it is. I knew there was an Origin Kano out here. So we're starting out with six and a half million health. I think we're just going to crank this straight to a ridiculous amount. Let's go to 15 million would be a nice start. Um, scorpions. Can you, like, look at me. Look at me. Do I look like I'm going to be a little pushover of some scorpions? Not quite. Let's give our dude here a little bit of a speed bump as well. Let's go to 300%. There we go. Also, who is, who is, ants? Ants, you want some of this? You want, you want some ants? You want some? Yeah, get out of my face. <laughs> get out of here. And we'll throw the remaining 19 levels into melee damage, all right? These ants are actually being a pain in the backside. Okay, so let's see what we can do. Um, I guess we got Kana coming for us. <laughs> insta hit and insta kill on the demonic uh, doggy thing. Let's see what I can do to a Kano. Oh, this is gonna get this is gonna get ridiculous. Oh, I missed him. Oh, I should probably wait. Do I have health potions on me? I actually have no idea. Um, all right, we're not powered up entirely. Oh wait, I'm not even powered up yet. Power me up. Power me up. What are we doing? Um, okay, health potion. Check. All right, now we can have some fun. All right. I actually don't even know if you can power these guys up the same way as you can power up demonics. Maybe you can't. Ooh. Have I gone and like... Have we depowered this thing? Is this guy weaker than he once was? All right, let me just get away from this guy real quick. Okay, you're a pest. Can you just put me down? I hate Kanos. I honestly hate... I hate... I... Ugh. Put me down, please. Let me run away. What is going on? I can't move. I'm... I'm trying to move. He's stunning me or something. Oh, I'm pooping. Stop pooping then, buddy. This is not the time for pooping. This is not the time to be pooping. All right, we're just going to have to fight fire with fire, literally. We'll just fight fire with annoyance. We're, we're fighting annoyance with fire. Tech yeah, look at my dude. Look at the trail of poop behind him. I think maybe what I got to do is just empty our inventory. That might actually be the only way out of this. Um, or, you know, just, just fighting this thing. Just fighting it before our stamina runs out. That's probably the other option. So we just keep pummeling them in the face. And yeah, we are powered up. I can see the buff at the top of the screen there. We're powered up. We do 600% damage and we take 55% less. So not only is this guy draining my stamina, we've also got our power up draining our stamina right now. It's down halfway. We should be able to take this Kano down before, you know, it annoys us any further. And also, have a look just up there at the top of the screen. This is a demonic thorny dragon. Our, our former form is up there to remind us where we've where we've come from. But hey, this battle here is shows us where we've how far we've come. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Anyways, that is that. He's got a couple million left, and we're out of here. You are annoying. Oh my gosh, Origin Kanos are so annoying. And look at the trailer poop. And I'm still doing it too. We're still dropping the trailer poop. This here. This is why I couldn't run away. Because every time I went to run, we just drop another deuce behind us. Anyways, at least we got some levels out of that. Unfortunately, we got no super potions. So that's a bit sucky. That would have been really nice to get some of uh, some of those max potions. So it's just one. One would have been great. Actually, anything would have been great. Gave me nothing. All right, Kano. Out of here, mate. Out of here. That's where we began. This thing right here, eh? Watch me kill it with a single hit. Simple as that. It's actual ridiculous how strong we are right now. Time to throw... And we've only put like 20 levels into melee damage, by the way. We've barely even gotten started with it. That's how crazy this whole thing is. All right. 
Is there anything else out here? If, if an origin pops up, I'll fight it. If not, I think it's time we go and uh, we go pay our new baby a visit. In fact, you know what? Why are we even out here right now when we've got Nova the Destroyer waiting for us at home? Let's get back to base right this second. I am, I am, I am. There is no reason for me to be out here when we've got a massive Dodo Reaper waiting for us. Probably fully grown, ready to check out. So, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Okay. 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 Let me park you over here, friend. There you go. Also, just on a side note, imagine what this would look like. With a, bit, with a bit of this. With a bit of this, like, visual action going on. Yes, it would be ridiculously powerful. But it'd be pretty freaking cool too. Alright, if you're wondering why I'm running inside. We're missing a saddle. Master... It gave me a Mastercraft saddle. It didn't even give me a full strength one. That's pretty poor. But it doesn't matter. Turns out these two are the same size. Spot on. Bang on prediction right there. Um, let's see. Let's see what you can do, friends. Saddle you. Actually, I'm riding you without a saddle. Okay, I guess you don't need a saddle to ride it. In fact, I'm assuming the saddle is more like armor or something. Let's get you healed up. I don't want you dying. You're very low on health right now. So let's fix that up. And uh, let's have a look. <laughs> let's have a look at what you can do. <laughs> oh, this thing's going to be majestic. He moves so quick as well. Look at this. Oh, can we just... Oh, where's all the fishies at? Oh, I wanted to see like a whole ton of death. I wanted to see a whole ton of death and destruction. You are the destroyer after all. Hey, this is only his bite attack. He's also got this. He's also got this attack. <laughs> ah. It's still going. Can I go and drop this in the forest? Oh, let's go wipe out the swamp. I hate the swamp. Also on a side note, real quick, real quick. Let's toggle those particles down, eh? They're just filling up my screen and making it really hard to see what I'm doing. All right, let's go. I'm too far into this jungle. I didn't want to come. Oh my gosh. I'm like, I'm sliding across the trees here. All right, we can just sit, sit. Come on, down we go. All right, there we go. All right, let's see. Let's have a look. Can I actually kill anything? I killed five dinosaurs with that explosion. That's it. Just wipe it. Look at, how did this only hit five different dinosaurs? Maybe because these, I'm, here we go. We're flying again. So I guess this is the weakness of the re this Dodo Reaper just, just slides across the map everywhere. Interesting. All right, let's have a look this time around, eh? Much better. That is what I was... That's what I wanted to see, basically. Uh, fantastic. That's beautiful. All right. We've also got a sea attack. Which might crash my computer. All right, that killed even more dinosaurs. Okay, that is the attack. That is the attack. Again, watch this. Ready? <gasps> There's a primal. There's a primal. All right, how about an X attack? We got an X attack? I don't know what. We just launched out our tail. Oh my gosh. Uh, I took down the entire forest. Oh, here it goes again. And C attack. Bam. <laughs> oh, this is good. Okay, no wonder. No wonder we lost our spirit rob in all the chaos. We also got this. Oh, that's an attack? Okay, that's our control. So that, that's what control does. I don't even know what it did. It just did a bunch of stuff. Um, see, the thing is, I think from what I'm seeing, it's great at area of effect damage. It's great at just damaging every... Oh, wow. Okay, now I'll take it back. I'll take it back. That Primal Carno just got absolutely annihilated. Uh, what I was going for, though, was it looks like we can attack a lot of things at the same time with this guy. But unfortunately, um, it seems like... As far as direct hitting a dinosaur, it's not that effective. But then again, if this kind of gets absolutely annihilated right here, which it, oh, yeah, we still do like a good 30 million. Oh, there's an origin Kano over there too. I don't really feel like dealing with an origin Kano. Well, we took the primal down. Can we take down another origin? I don't even know what's happening anymore, guys. I don't even, I don't even know. I don't even know. I can't see a thing. I don't even know where I, how did I get over here? I don't even know where the, I don't know where the origin Kano went. Um, I reckon he's right there. He's in the water. Anyways, I just wanted to see how fast I can take him down. Oh, yeah. How about with a little control blast? Can we hit it with a little... Can we hit it with a little... Yeah, you know what? I don't feel like finishing it off, eh? <laughs> I reckon I might... I've fought enough Origin Cardos for one day. Let's take this guy home because I ain't got time for another one of these guys to be carrying him around. And guys, on that note... 
I think we're going to call it a day right here. If you did enjoy it, please go ahead and punch that thumbs up. Make it rain those thumbs ups. But most importantly, keep on smiling. Have a fantastic day and I'll catch you next time. Bye. For now.